Hey guys, and welcome to my review of Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice. Superman is directed by Zack Snyder, and it stars Ben Affleck, Henry Cavill, Amy Adams, and Jesse Eisenberg. This is the first of many superhero films that come out this year, so I had a lot of pressure on it to come out swinging and set the bar high for the rest of the films coming out this year, and it came in with mixed results. First of all, Ben Affleck is absolutely great as Batman. All people's doubts about the casting has been shattered, as he gives an amazing performance as both Batman and Bruce Wayne. Well, after one performance, it's hard to say whether he'll be better than Christian Bale, but I can say is I'm now even more excited for the solo film. Another standout of the film's cast is Gal Gadot as Wonder Woman. Now, just like with Affleck, there are a lot of reservations with her casting, but she did an amazing job. I now can't wait to see her solo film, which comes out next year. If nothing else, this film is pretty damn entertaining, and this is in large part due to the film's action, which is amazing as you would come to expect Zack Snyder. One Batman action sequence in particular feels like it's ripped straight from the Arkham games and I absolutely love it. The score, which is done by Hans Zimmer and John Kirksell, is also great. It has a lot of those really loud epic moments that you'll expect from these two. But for me, the standout of the score is the opening track, which is both haunting and beautiful. Other texts, including visual effects, cinematography, and sound editing and mixing are also worth a mention. Jesse Eisenberg's performance as Lex Luthor is a pretty controversial topic. Some people absolutely love it, while others think it was just an over-top mess akin to Eddie Redmayne's performance in Jupiter Ascending. For me personally, I'm not sure how I quite feel about this performance. At some parts I loved it, but other times I felt like it was way too much like the Riddler or the Jericho and not like Lex. I respect Snyder and Crow's decision to go with this take for the character, but I'm not sure it quite paid off. The writing at times was very problematic, and I feel like about 10 to 20 minutes could have been shaved off the runtime. The pacing of this film was also a bit shoddy, and this is largely due to the editing, which was very jumpy and didn't have nice transitions from one scene to the next. Henry Cavill's performance as Superman was a mixed one. He had a couple of really good scenes, but other times he was a bit wooden. All in all, this was an enjoyable film, which did have its problems, but it has got me excited for future films in the DCU. I'm giving this one 7.7 .7 out of 10. That would just about do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I'll see you soon. Bye!